Over the past several decades, there have been numerous advances in the management of head and neck cancer in general, and in particular, head and neck surgery. Exposure to critical areas, such as the nose, the nasal pharynx, oropharynx, and skull base, can be effectively and safely performed, often using minimally invasive techniques. Reconstructive surgery of the head and neck has experienced a revolution during this time period, primarily due to advances in microvascular surgery. In addition, multidisciplinary teams have successfully merged the expertise of head and neck reconstructive surgeons, oral and maxillofacial surgeons, maxillofacial prosthodontists, and oculoplastic surgeons. The past 25 years has seen an explosion of reconstructive techniques that have greatly expanded our ability to restore the function and the aesthetics following otherwise devastating cancer surgery. Recent reports have also documented the very positive impact of these sophisticated reconstructive and restorative approaches on patient survival. We now have the ability to remove cancers from the head and neck and restore a quality of life that was previously impossible to imagine and to do so in a predictable fashion. One of the most important advances is the ability to merge implant techniques with the transfer of vascularized bone to the maxillofacial skeleton. These implants provide a much enhanced ability to fix prostheses that include teeth, as well as prosthetic noses, eyes, and ears. Through a highly integrated team approach involving multiple disciplines who intervene in a patient's care from the very outset, implants are placed very early after reconstructive surgery and sometimes at the time of that initial surgery. The enhanced stability of these prostheses has advanced patient function, their comfort, and their ability to cope with their deformity.